Results are coming in on issues that affect each and every Mid-Southerner tonight. Mm -hmm. From gubernatorial races to a handful of municipal mayors, even recreational marijuana, voters are making their voices heard. Thank you for joining us. I'm Kim Clark. And I'm Joy Redman. Our Decision 22 2022 live team coverage begins tonight in West Memphis. Action News 5's Parker King joining us with more on the marijuana vote. Parker, that could change lives in the natural state. Yeah, Kim, Joy, we're talking about recreational marijuana issue for the constitutional amendment that would allow that in the state of Arkansas. All evening we've been monitoring results from NBC and the Secretary of State's office. Both have had fairly similar results, those results leaning against issue four, that that, that initiative that would that would give recreational marijuana. Now, keep in mind, at last check, according to NBC, only about 30% of the vote is currently showing Showing. That's according to the Arkansas Secretary of State's office and NBC. The rest of the votes are trickling in slowly but surely. Currently, 50 56% of those voters rather say no to recreational marijuana, while the remaining 44 say yes. We were in West Memphis this evening while the polls were still open, and a lot of voters we spoke with said they support recreational marijuana, but that there aren't enough votes to allow this in what they call a Bible Belt state. Now, the results in Crittenden County, West Memphis, are flipped with that. Currently, 55% at last check of voters in this county say yes, 45% say no. Now, if these numbers hold, Arkansas will continue to have their medical program, which has 90,000 patients at last check. If, however, more votes are coming in, then the mentality of yes to a recreational program, this is what residents can expect. The measure would go into effect November 18th. Now, the number of cultivators and dispensaries would expand. Three of the 40 dispensaries already are here in West Memphis. You meet, you have to be 21 years of age to purchase medical uh, recreational marijuana and you can only have one ounce at a time. What's more is that it's anticipated that over the next five years the tax revenue coming from recreational marijuana could bring in as much as four hundred and sixty one million dollars to the state of Arkansas that would be divided amongst four different aspects. The general fund, law enforcement, medical research with the University of Arkansas and also drug court programs. Now, like we've been saying, these votes are trickling in slowly but surely. We're going to stay on this to bring you the latest results as they come and answer the question that we've been having for months now on if Arkansas will have recreational marijuana or not. We'll send it back to you, Kim and Joy. Live here in West Memphis, Parker King, Action News 5. Yeah, Kim, that was